Melissa here and welcome back to Let's Talk with Melissa and Paul. I don't know if you can tell, but um, oh, I think it was Saturday. Paul took me to get my hair cut. I don't know how much my fan is blowing it around, but I have to do the video right here because I've got a big Vornado fan down here. I am having some serious hot flashes right now. So I have to cool down before I can even get in with William because I am miserable. <clears throat> but um, Paul and I spent another $75 the last two days. Uh. Actually more than that, she spent another uh, seven on top of that. So that was the replace 82, with the dogs broke. $82 these last couple days on stuff for William. So I wanted to show you. Now keep in mind that the reason we've had to go back and buy some stuff is because I had no idea, um, you know, how much bedding or whatnot I needed. So um, the little bag of bedding I initially bought, I'm almost done with it. In fact, Samuel, I mean Samuel, oh my Lord. Paul, if you want to get the plastic container, I can also show them what we initially bought because I never did make a video of that. Yes, Master, yes, Master. <laughs> But all this stuff here is new in this bag here but um, here I'll are. show you thank you here you are master what we initially bought uh. and Paul found this really nice um, plastic blocking bin for me at Walmart it was for the initial table we put them on but we got uh, a lower table so I can watch him so keep in mind this is what we initially bought okay See what I mean? We initially bought this KT Soft Granule Blend. I'm down to this much because um, I clean his cage daily. Um, I, I want to do it that way. I don't want it to get real dirty. So, <clears throat> and I don't put a whole lot in there. But still, that's we've gone through that. We bought him this uh, rabbit forage mix salad this, the young rabbit food we bought him was Vita Prima complete nu nutrition sunseed he likes this and what I do is I mix a little bit of this on top of his pellets we're still using this this is Sunseed um, Timothy Hay. And this is also Sunseed Animal Lovers Garden Patch. These are little treats, very hard treats. They're shaped as flowers. And I can't get it out right now. Carrots, he likes these. I put a couple in there at the start of the day. Um, this All Living Things Market Collection Chicken and Waffle Chews. He's got the little uh, chicken in there. He hasn't done much with it, so hopefully um, he likes carrying he'll it eventually around. get it. You know, that eventually won it. This was Enriched Life by Oxbow Timothy Carrot Lollipop. I'm holding some of this stuff back because they said you need to rotate their stuff. So, there's that. He has one of these from Oxbow Enriched Life, Shake, Rattle, and Roll. Hasn't done much with this, but like I said, he has a lot of stuff, and I'm sure he'll eventually get to it. These are so cute, I can't wait to give this to him. This is All Living Things S'mores Chews. They look like s'mores. Really, really cute. Um, his... Small dog, uh, small dogs and cats, um, nail clippers. They're for the rounded nails, not, you know, the flat nails. He also has a metal comb. It's over there that I bought to brush him. So this is what we initially bought William. Not including what's already in his cage. Yeah. Yeah, not including, um, 
We've spent quite a bu bunch of money. We're done for a while. Make <laughs> note. <laughs> yeah, we, um, uh, yes, we have been spoiling young William, but we love him and we want him to have nice things and be happy. So, the next $82 that we spent, um, we went to, I don't know if you guys have one of these near you, but I have trouble saying it. I'm going to tell you right now. Excuse me. A rural, rural, R-U-R-A-L, King. And they sell all kinds of uh, stuff for animals and pets and, you know, different stuff. So, I ended up getting two of this size of a litter pan. Now, I know some of you rabbit people I've been watching on the internet probably think this is too small for, that I should have bought the big, huge pan, which was huge. Keep in mind, William is a dwarf lion head. He's not going to get big, so I felt like this was big enough. One is in his playpen right now, and once I get done showing you all this stuff, we will... Um, I'll get in the playpen and um, show you that. We got two fresh sheets down, so he's all ready to go. Like I said, I rotate and clean his area very nice and clean. So he's got two of these. This one is going to go in his extra large habitat. So um, that's what the other one's for. One's already in there. Okay, let's start with the big stuff. Um, I've already added some of this into his playpen last night. He likes this. This is KT uh, Natural Timothy Hay Plus with carrot. He likes this. You can see the little bits of carrot back there. Hence the reason why it's already been opened. I hope that's not disturbing you being able to see. We picked up this nice big thing of Timothy Hay. So he still has some hay in there. He has this new Hay Plus in this. I won't open this one right now, but um, wanted to get it, get him that. This is uh, 96 ounces. Okay, now, got a much bigger, it's compacted in there. It says it's 72 liters. Um, KT Clean and Cozy. This is the paper you know, bit shredded paper stuff. Odor control, 99.9 .9 dust free, two times more absorbent than the wood shavings. I am not quite sure how I feel about shavings yet, but I really, uh, the kind that he got that's, you know, really small um, paper, I liked it, so I went ahead and got this. Okay, now, some fun stuff. The more fun stuff. Paul picked up these uh, Wear Pet Products Large Critter Pops, these fun shoes. They're orange and green, or maybe that's considered red. We got this KT Bunny Flip and Toss Wooden Carrot. I think you can tell just from the brands that I've been getting, these are the brands that they carry in my area. The KT brand, the Oxbow. I really like the Oxbow stuff. Um, he's got a place set in there by Oxbow that he loves. So anyhow, there's that. Paul picked up this little ball um, in, by Oxbow, Enriched Life Loco Ball. He's got two balls in his playpen, and he just kicks them around like crazy. Yeah, he has three balls that we bought at Walmart that came in a set, and they're all, they go from light to medium to heavy. He really enjoys those. So this is another type that looks like it with these little things sticking out. So there's that. This is very interesting that Paul got. I imagine you probably could take this apart, but I think it's meant to keep large like this. Wear Pet Products um, Fun Chew Mega Munch Sticks. This was 
one of the initial uh, chewies we got him. He's already chewed it because I can't find it anymore. Um, Fun Chew by Wear Pet Products Wedgie or Veggie Wedge. This has um, it's a crispy loofah, nutritious alfalfa hay. Now the lady said this little bit of alfalfa will not hurt him. They don't recommend buying alfalfa hay. As you can see, we bought Timothy hay. This came from Petland. He really, really, really likes the other one that we had, so he'll be getting that. We're down. Oh yeah, his wear, his Himalayan salt is by wear, the same brand. We're down to the very last item. This is Oxbow again, Enriched Life Timbells. Made with Timothy Hay, exploring or playing and chewing. There's four of those. I think what you do, no, it's it's like a dumbbell. So technically it's two. They've got them tied together right now, but that would be two separate ones. So that is what we have bought for William. So I'm going to sit in there with him and I'm going to figure out um, which uh, new toys that we're going to let him have. So I'll get a pair of scissors. So we're going to pause right here and then I'm going to be in the playpen. Keep in mind, his playpen is very, very nice. It is seven, over seven feet long by four and a half feet wide. That is how we set the panels up. It's a huge amount of space for one tiny little bunny. Okay. See, here's one of those shake, rattle, and roll things. What's his other toy? It was, oh, it, maybe it went back in the cage. That's fine. Okay. Here's the litter pan. I've got it in the corner. I've got the hay on the one end, and I have thrown some of his poopy in there. And I've got some of the litter on the other end. I hope that's how you're supposed to do it. Yeah. This, as you can see, he has been chewing on this. He likes that. And he's been chewing on this bigger ball. Okay. I think I'm going to give him one of these. Because this is so much space, it looks like there's not enough stuff in here. Look, young William. Timothy Hay dumbbells. Oh, I'm not going to give him this ball right now since he already has three balls. Oh, look, he likes it. He's already chomping on it. Fit. You stay out of it. That's not yours, Finny. Here's his little chicken to the chicken and waffles thing. Right there, I just tossed it closer to him. It's got fresh water. Plenty of hay. I just uh, cleaned out his uh, water dish and um, cleaned out his pellet dish. Added more pellets. Fresh water. <laughs> you like it, baby? Took right to it. 
since the dogs ruined his initial tunnel, um, we just have it in there for him to like stand on. But here's his brand new fresh one for him to run through because he really does enjoy that. just going to have some William ASMR. I'm going to be quiet for a little bit and just so you can hear him. He likes that little maze area that Paul did. Oh, look, he's laying down. Hey, oh. Look, Emma and Finn are trying to get in the litter pan of his toys. See if he'll dance for you. Hi, sweet boy. Let me move my foot so you can. See, here's his hospital. What would you like from the corner? Hi, baby. stuff we put in. That's new. Yeah. gone to town on the end of this toy. Hi, sweet boy. Yeah, you can chomp, you can chomp, uh, chomp on the stick too. You like that? Is that good?
loves his toy. Chelsea's starting to get happy. I'm trying to stay in my corner to give you more room for you. Oh. I have to sit on a cushion for my tushy. It's hardwood floors. Not very soft on the behind. So he's hopping. water. Good Paul. He likes that crunchy stick. <laughs> Got a new tunnel. Got your new tunnel, sweetie. Here he goes. He's zooming. Go 
I'm sorry, our dogs are choosing to be bad right now while we're trying to See him hop and do his twist. He hopped and twisted. Then oh. stop pushing the pin. He keeps pushing it with his nose. No, you don't want to push the baby. I want to eat the cushion, William. <laughs> He's curious about the pillow I'm sitting on. I like how this turned out today with the flat sheet and then a flat uh, blanket versus all the little ones. This faux, um, I have a faux Sherpa blanket that I can put down the next time. It got kind of hard because I... I didn't know how at the time how you're supposed to take care of Sherpa to keep it soft, but we have a lot of animal blankets. Good, William. You like your rabbit food? Benny stopped. I'm not quite sure what Ben's obsession is, but he keeps taking his nose and pushing at these panels. mind I'm new to this I don't claim to be an expert about anything uh, when I was looking for a playpen like this they had one that was in metal in hindsight maybe I should have got the metal one instead of you know these plastic um, just because of how the dogs are acting but like say if we go to build on this I wonder if I could get the metal set and put the metal set down here and then use these see-through pieces on the second level. I don't see why I couldn't if they're set up the same way. So that's a possibility. Hi, William. You are so handsome. You're so handsome.
hit you. He's grooming himself. He's so flipping cute. He has two different types of hanging toys in his habitat and the one he was has a bell on it he was ringing it a little bit last night I can't with this setup I can't really hang anything but that's okay because he's got tons of other things I love it when Peanut does that and cleans himself with his hands like that. He's very interested in the other animals. He likes looking at them. Is your ball? Is that one of your balls, William? Is it more groomy? Everyone loves your how your hair sticks up. Timothy Dumbbell. And you got your chewy stick. William. Finn. William. Oh my gosh, look how he's laying. He's very relaxed. him digging at his sheet over there. He's sitting at the 
first time I've seen him dig up a blanket like that. William! William! No, don't eat the blanket, William! 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 your tree? William. Mm -hmm. start your happy dance? when they do that. Did you see how he's like rolled over? He's in a very vulnerable position. Aww. Well, yeah, I'm so happy you're happy. He's chewing on a blanket. Oh, what do you got? You don't want to chew on a blanket. Okay, everyone. I'm not sure how long this. We're about what? 30 minutes? I have no idea. I'm not sure. But we wanted to give you some time to see William playing and looking at some of his new toys. I got to go in that corner and fix the blanket. I'm not sure why he's digging up the blanket over there. But um, just want to make sure he doesn't try to eat it with all his other chewable stuff in here. But as you can see, he has a very large. <laughs> plate area. Um, he is happy. He does his happy dance. What he's doing. And he's been doing zoomies. He's been flopping down. So I think he is a very happy baby. He's very spoiled. So make sure you check in. Um, every day we're going to be making a video. Okay, everyone. Say goodbye, William lovers. See you next time. Oh, see you next time. Bye, everyone. If you have enjoyed this video, click the subscribe button to get the latest context. And check out the other great clips on Let's Talk with Melissa and Paul on the YouTube network. Thank you.